Hey everybody, it's BC here. Welcome to another episode of City Skylines. And I'm just uh, in first person right now, going all around through our little town of, or our boom town now of, oh, that was a close one, <laughs> of uh, Britska Grumbum Plummet. Uh, we'll call it BCP from now on, it's going to be a little bit of a tongue twister. But yeah, so we are going along, and this is, this is actually what I was talking about, like these, uh, almost like a European style, I think these are. But they're like totally, completely stand out from the rest of the buildings. They're actually quite something. <laughs> this one stands out a little bit more. Don't ask me about this one. The Birdsong Residence. Well, yeah. Would you believe me if I told you that I've actually seen yellow houses like that in my, in my city? But yeah. So here we are. We are doing pretty good. As you can see, we've got a lot of residential demand. Uh, we do have a power situation we do have to deal with. And uh, as you can see, we're suffering already. So we do have some money. We do have our advanced turbines. So we're going to go ahead and pause things. First, we're going to start getting our money back from these. Now we should be getting... Should be getting 4500 refund. Let's find out. Why was it giving me a refund before? That's weird. I haven't done anything to the game since. Hmm. Yeah, I could have sworn I saw seeing refund on some things unless we don't get refunds anymore once we get to a certain level in the game. That kind of blows my plan out of the water, but oh well. We can always put one down just because. So yeah, as you can see, we do get the darker and lighter areas in here. So let's, let's put it over there. And grab some power lines, just stick that over a lot like that. And then we can start worrying about this mess over here. Oh, that's weird. Uh, it's almost like there's a bit of a wave going through on the water. But anyways, uh, yeah, let us start expanding here. You know what it will do? Let's actually have a look at our area map here. How much do they want? 3,700 is actually not that bad. I think... I think that'd be a smart idea. Do that. Just give us a little more room to work out, so because we're going to get pretty crunched up here. I think we're going to be focusing mainly on industrial in this area here, as we are going to need it. Uh, anyways, let's start building some roads. So let's see, what do I have here? Let's spring it on out. Go to there, and like so. Mm -hmm. And then, like so, and usual stuff. So let me get all this gridded out, and I will be right back. Okay, I'm all done. I got a little water pipes laid down too. Uh, see how the power is. We're doing okay, but we're going to be getting a lot of people here pretty soon. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to zone this section here. And then what I might try to do is I might try to keep like well try to keep the commercial pockets sort of how they are. If you understand what I'm talking about, I have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm just winging it. No, I'm not actually. Uh, uh, yeah, let's put another commercial here. Oh, missed that little spot there. Get some more residential. Another one there. Like so. And see how it goes. We're gonna... Yeah, we can start expe Actually, no. No. Power. Power, power, power. Okay. Now I can't spend any money. Not yet, anyways. I will soon, though. So, there we are. We are flourishing. I'm wondering... That should be a good size. I was wondering if that's 
good enough block size, but that should be good. I don't see why it wouldn't be. And there is money. Now we need the industrial. So we'll slow that down a little bit. I want to make sure the money keeps trickling in. Uh, while we're here, let's check the garbage. Yeah, 15 trucks in use already. Yeah. Maybe we might have to stick another. Let's actually do that. Because I don't care about the freeway. Nobody does. So we are going to stick a landfill over here if I can. Yeah, I actually have the money for it. I don't. Oh, I can't place it there. Hmm. Such a high pollution radius, too. You know what? Let's expand that road. Just one more, I think, should do it. Not quite. Got to go a couple more. Actually, I'm doing this stupid. I think I'll just put it over here. Jeez, I'm doing something wrong. Who would have thought, huh? I'm kidding. I get things right partially. Part of the time, I should say. It's usually when I can actually talk. Okay, that is going to be an issue. Yeah, we're going to have to reconfigure the power grid here. So we're going to speed things up so we can get a little bit of cash. And then we're going to pause it. Okay. So actually, let's do it this way instead. Go to the power wires. Uh, I think what I can do might work. Technically, I should zone all this area, but I think what I'll do is I'm just going to do that, and then we can get rid of all this. Oh, I got rid of something I didn't want to get rid of. Okay, you're over there. Don't really need power. I forgot about that. We could put power lines out in the water, too. Because then all we really have to do is just go up to here to have a connection. From like here to there. And then get rid of all this. Because then technically it should be all be connected. Uh, actually, give it a second. Let it oh, power. I think it's going to come up at the end of the month here. And today. Ooh, not quite. Okay. And I forgot to do something. I forgot to find out the hotkey for both of those. So I'm going to do that right now. B. <laughs> Bulldoze. <laughs> yeah, go figure, huh? Yeah. Who would have thought they would actually would have gotten it? So someone should actually figure out what they're doing. Okay, is that going to get power? No. Hmm. I don't want to put it there, though. I haven't got the money anymore. Ugh. I'm broke. You know what we'll do? Let's do this. Let's put put another a little zone in here. Uh, industrialize that. Let's speed it up here quickly. And in theory, as soon as someone develops, come on. Come on. Crippling my city. Alright. Well, that wasn't going to work. But that will. Come on. Somebody just build there. There we go. Thank you. What's going on here? Ooh, 
Why is it flooded? It's supposed to be out in the water. If I just got it like... Oh, 2400. It's because it's too close to the shore. Oh, I have to move the other one then. Why are they flooded? They're supposed to be out in the water, are they not? They build in bodies of water and they flood. That doesn't make any sense. Anyway, let's slow this down before things get out of control again. Alright, let's see how we are doing here. Okay, we are doing okay. We're gonna need sewage from oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot to hook something back up to the grid. Okay, you can stop complaining now. Sewage problems? What sewage problems? I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, we need commercial. We need commercial, we need more residential. So I think I'm going to go put the commercial here. Like that. And we'll need some more residential. There. Uh, I'm trying to be careful not to go over the existing zones in case it does actually... Uh, rezone it because I think that's what happens if uh, this building's already on it it'll, it doesn't rezone it or if there isn't buildings on it it rezones it oh yeah this is uh, what I'm doing I am going to go ahead and use my hotkey so I can actually bulldoze that and do the right thing for a change yay I actually know what I'm doing or that's how I make it look anyways so I'll do that, we'll get rid of get rid of that road there, we'll go back to zoning and more industrial and industrial here, just because uh, actually, you know what, I'm wondering where is it, where is it, where is it it's not here it's over here Let's see what we have for resources we might have to get to some industry soon. Nothing around here to, except for the forest. I was wondering if that black was actually the oil, but it wasn't. Okay, that is fine. Not a problem. Okay, now we just need that industrial to flourish, which it is doing. As soon as I speed things up, make sure water is not under control. It is now. Alright. So there we are. So what is our situation like? Oh yeah, we could use more fire. We could use more money to be honest. I'm actually thinking, let's actually do this. Uh, let's slow this down for now. Move this over to here. Oh, don't complain. You're going to be getting another one here pretty quick. As soon as I get the money. Okay. Let's pause it before I lose the money. Now, let's see. we got one over there. We could use it. I think that'd be a good spot right there. Uh, police. We're doing okay. Let's check our medical. It's hanging in there. And education, terrible. What do we need for another school? Ten grand. Uh, I think we could do that. Uh, we do have to look at transit eventually, but I think we'll be okay. Power situation is going to be a struggle, that's for sure. We're already starting to reach capacity on the water, so we'll have to get a couple more pumps in there. Eventually. So let's see how we're doing here. In fact... How much are the water pumps? Be five grand. I think we'll be okay for the time being. How's our demands? More commercial, huh? More commercial. I, oh, look at that. Buildings are upgrading. Oh, this is nice. So far. 
Wait till the traffic problems hit. Then there'll be issues. Okay, what we can do here? I think commercial doesn't care too much about pollution, so maybe... Maybe we won't do that. Don't want to cripple the grid. Oh, we have money. Let's do this. Let's uh, avoid disaster while we can. Let's get the pipes in the right spot. Okay. Make sure I did put a pumping station there. Not a... Not a... Uh, a mud maker, we'll call it. We'll just call it a mud maker. Yeah. Okay, that is connected. Uh, should look into the drainage eventually too. I'm gonna look at this stuff here. Yeah, mods. I, I think, I think what this is, you use this with these those pipes there and uh, it allows you to take care of like water and stuff like that um, I took dynamic weather off so I'm gonna assume that doesn't that means it's not gonna actually rain in the game so I might have to turn that back on but I paused here what's this not enough educated workers yeah schooling and we do have some some you know funeral services we have to deal with eventually how much is a cemetery? 8,000. Uh, cemetery or school? Hmm. I'm going to have to do that cemetery. That would be a good place for this. I guess it doesn't really matter. We'll just stick it right there. And then we wait for the money so we can build another school. Which actually won't take that take very long. Look at that, we're closing in on 5,000. Uh, let's see, where is that other school? That school's there, so maybe this one will go here. Perfect. All right, more residential, actually. Before we go any further. Yes, power. Power is becoming... What is going on there? I tell you the water physics in this game. It's like mud. That's actually sped up. This is real time. Wow. Real game time. Oh. I'm wondering if this is like a, a mini tsunami. Oh wow, look at that. Uh oh. Don't tell me I got a tsunami on my hands here. Yeah, what is going on here? What? I have no idea what happened. Okay, I'm going to do something here. We're going to go into the options here. We're going to go into the right and rock options. Pause on disaster. So whenever there's a disaster, it's going to pause automatically. Uh, I should be getting warnings, but... Yeah, that, that kind of worries me. Absolutely no idea why that happened or what caused it. For all I know, it could be me messing around with the game speed too much. You're flooding my windmills, man. Yeah, usually when you see stuff like that, it usually means it's like a tsunami. That is crazy. Look at that, the sewage is spilling all over the land. Oh no. <sighs> Does that mean I have to go to land windmills now? See, now this one's flooded again. Uh, we'll have to move you then. And hopefully you actually work. And it's flooding again. Ah. <sighs> 
I might have to start building more of these again. How much part does that produce? 40 megawatts. Ugh. Oh, we might have to actually do that. Because that's going to be an issue. Definitely going to be an issue. Oh, what's the pollution level like on this? Oh, God, this is going to be terrible. Oh, I guess the red is the pollution. Oh, so much for going green. But even here, is it going to get flooded? Like, what is going on? Unfortunately, I can't even see what's going on out there. If I didn't say, know any better, I'd say we have a tsunami coming. Oh well, we'll, <laughs> we'll deal with that when the time comes. We might as well go ahead and just build this thing. Uh, get the power under control. Before that becomes a serious issue. Oh well. As long as people want to keep moving here, I don't care. Alright, we have that. Uh, check that water situation, that is good. Uh, industrial. Well, you guys are going to get flooded out pretty soon, so... Uh, hmm. We might have to relocate. Let's go over here, since I already got this road built. Go over here, we'll do... Not much, because I don't have much money, so we'll have to go... On yield cheetah speed. And just like that, everything gets back up and running. I still like to know what's going on with this water. It does worry me because I do have the uh, disasters DLC. Alright, well, let's slow this down. It's getting out of control here. What am I doing? Uh oh. We have an issue. Why is it abandoned? What do you mean no electricity? Oh. Oops. It wasn't providing to the grid. <sighs> I lost so many people. No, oh, that's the wrong button. I was trying to speed up time. So all those buildings are abandoned. Are they? Uh -huh. Yeah, so abandoned buildings don't actually use power. That's a shame. Speed things up, see, people, see if people move back in. And they do. Good. It's like nothing ever happened. Okay, I do have some money. Let's uh, start working on uh, another industrial area over here. Yeah, maybe we'll do it down here. I'll definitely have to keep the city separate from it. Or do I? Because I'm kind of worried about this flooding air over here now. Like, is this going to be a common occurrence? Is this because of me messing around with the game speed too much? I don't know. But we'll just go ahead and build. So, B, get rid of those. And we'll get some more rows down. Like that. 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 And then... So, a whole bunch of industrial. Need some more commercial too. I think we're gonna actually start expanding this way a little bit. Keep an eye on the fun situation. So that's gonna be one. Let's go. Let's go for. Go all the way over to here. Uh, you are not connecting. Why? 
Uh, I think I goofed it up. Even with a mod, I can't even build it right. <gasps> no, I can't because I actually have that off. Alright, let me fix this. Oh yeah, regarding the refund, apparently it's on roads, so I can't get refunds on the windmills. But, yeah. Okay, so I just wanted to go up to there, that's why. You know, sometimes that snap doesn't snap as much as it should. Yeah, something's going all screwy here. I wonder if it's just like a ter an elevator, a terrain issue. Possibly. Alright, let's go ahead and spin roads. Keep an eye on the money. Or it's me not paying attention to the actual snapping locations. Not enough money. Come on. I got money. It's just in my citizens' wallets right now. Okay. So yeah, this is the one that's got to change here. Yeah, mods are good. Mods are really good if you actually know how to use them properly. For some reason, it was actually off there. I don't know why, but do that, and it actually lines up perfectly with the cemetery. Keep things speeding up. So I can build, and I think I still have to lay pipes in this area too. Uh, let's check. Yes, I do. Uh, go there, and there, and there. Okay. So now we need some commercial. We can get... Let's see what we got here. Ah, commercial would be perfect right here. Get some commercial in there. Get some, some more residential. Oh, look at them just flourishing. Uh, more residential means more commercial. More commercial means more residential. And both of them means more industrial in the end. Okay. Look at that. Doing so well. Oh, look at that. We're going to be hitting 5,000 soon. Extend this. And just... Yeah, the nodes seem to be off. I think that's what's going on here. Don't mind me. There we go. We are a busy town. City policies, oil industry, more specialization, free public transit. Uh, we can make freeways, got all sorts of new roads, and more good stuff. Tsunami warning buoy. Is that a sign? <laughs> Is that a sign? Is that what was going on? Uh, let's actually see how expensive that thing is. Uh, where would that be? Somewhere in emergency services here, probably underwater. No, um, hmm. Anyway, give me one second here. Okay, I found it was actually under the fire department, under disaster services. And there's actually, right here. I don't know if I wanna actually get that right now but that is that I was also looking at a few other things here too like uh, if we go back to water uh, a pumping service is actually a fleet of trucks that actually go out and uh, vacuum out flooded buildings so people can move back in so that's actually quite, quite interesting there's also a, a reservoir so uh, yeah, so in other words, it's a, just water storage. If something happens with the pumps, at least people don't run out of water. And there's other things to freshwater outlet. And that's for like the storm drains and stuff like that. But I was also looking at the time here. And we're actually due to end the episode. But so far we are surviving. Uh, need more industri industrial again. I was working on that. I was going to try to get another industrial area here. But maybe we'll... Next episode, we'll maybe we'll bridge across the river here and start getting a nice big industrial area over here. Maybe even try to get some industry going, like actual industry. But right now, we there isn't much 
here. Like, we do have a lot of forestry, obviously. Uh, I think we actually have access to... Yeah, we have access to agriculture right here. We can get some farming going. So that could be something we can do. Yeah. Right now, we don't have any ore or any metal or oil. Got lots of trees, but... Uh, we might look at and getting into some lumber maybe next episode. But anyways, uh, that's going to be it for this one. Let's uh, get out of here. Yes. And then let's go pick a nice spot in our city. I think I'd have a nice look at it. Not over there. It's all dirty. Let's go see our bustling commercial district. Take a walk down Main Street, shall we? Make sure we're on normal speed. And there we go. Dino oil. Cool. Let's see what else we got here. A little. I have no idea what that is. Uh, oh, jeez. I thought we could actually go inside there. Some of these buildings are, like, so detailed. Like, look at this. You wouldn't even expect them to have, like, open bay doors or, like, a dumpster with actual dents on it. Oh, look at seeing about adjusting the speed of the first person camera walking too, because this is pretty fast. Going nuts, going nuts. <laughs> it's hilarious. And there we go, that's the pop shop. Oh my god, that's actually a real thing. I don't know if everybody remembers the pop shop. Uh, maybe it's just something that was only in Canada, but that was like super cheap pop. The most obscure flavors, but it was like awesome pop. It was great. Uh, anyways, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Beep beep. Move, move. Haha, I can walk past you.